Hi, my name is Eileen Perez and I'm an astrophysicist and this is When Was Pluto Declared a Dwarf Planet? So, in 2003, we discovered a planet that was very similar to Pluto, but it was actually larger. And uh, upon this discovery, we started wondering what to do about all these objects that have not been classified that are very similar to Pluto. So in 2003, we got um, a planet-like object that was 2,356 kilometers in diameter. Pluto is actually only 2,300 kilometers in diameter. So then we were going to have our 10th planet. So we started revisiting what makes up a planet. And clearly, Pluto has been the oddball for a while. Um, generally, the terrestrial planets are near the sun. Then you have the gas giants. And then we had Pluto, which was this, it was so small. Its orbit was crossing Neptune. It was tilted. It had a moon out over half of its side. There was a lot of things that were wrong with the classification of Pluto as a planet. So finally, in 2006, we decided to classify these objects as dwarf planets. So 2006, we ended up classifying them as dwarf planets. We still have about 400 objects that need classification. Some of them are, are more, more likely to become dwarf planets. Some of them are just going to remain as debris. But uh, this is what happened to Pluto. And so in 2006, Pluto was uh, determined to be a dwarf planet. My name is Eileen Perez, and I'm an astrophysicist, and this is how Pluto became a dwarf planet.